Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. This will go from October 7th through the 13th, 2019. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, subscribing to the channel, and commenting. Alright, so let's get into this. Alright, thank you to those who are new, those who are returning. Alright, so Pisces, let's see what we have for you. How you come into the week is a five of air. Okay. So you come into the week indecisive. Um, maybe combative. Um, this is a situation where you, you might no one wins here. This could be a love affair. This could be something existing going on. Um, you may be fighting with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is just a situation where if you pick the other or you pick, you know, e either or is going to be terrible for some party here. This could be a love affair. This could be drama. This could be someone behaving childishly. This is rumor. This is scandal. This is um, high anxiety, high high turbulence uh, this is also feeling a sense of failure and loss okay so uh, geez that's how you come into the week or, or someone around you is feeling that way okay the challenge here is the three of water okay so trying to even in the midst of you know drama indecision love affairs you're still trying to remain or have a happy appearance about yourself or happy countenance about yourself you also may be trying to create or recreate or do the energy work or put the emotion behind creating something stable here once again it could be where there's more parties more than one party involved you've been dealing with so much heavy energy here there is a need to just have fun whatever that may look like for you the advice of the cards is the king of water to remain balanced trustworthy um It is okay for you to open your heart and your mind to those around you. But remain balanced. Don't let anything tip the scale in regards to maybe some some indiscretion, some discord, some disruption, some interference here. Uh, continue creating whatever it is you're trying to create or recreate. If you take the advice of the cards, the outcome is the eight of air. The outcome will be an illusion of feeling trapped, stuck, but needing to do something or learn something for yourself, um, wanting to be in something more challenging, more easy, more give and take. Uh, six of Earth, Six of Air, Page of Earth. It's almost as if the Pisces is saying, I'm doing something. I'm doing this for myself. I have chosen this path for myself. But then something or someone makes you feel stuck or trapped or locked in. It says let go of the control issues here. A peaceful and more calm, placid, happier times can come for you when you let go. Let's see what this dynamic is about. Let's see what the shells have to say. A blessing. Nice. Oh. And closure. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's like, so something is a blessing and then something is being closed. It's as if 
as if the Pisces is saying, I want to do something for me. I want to choose a different path for me. I am. I have analyzed this and I have made the choice with these two sixes that something else fits me better. Something else is healthier for me. I, there's a sense of usefulness for this person, place, or thing in my life. I have analyzed what is now and I want to go into what can be. All right, so it's a blessing, but not before closing. Closure. Five of air and eight of air. Feeling trapped and stuck, but needing to let go. Uh, Pisces, I hope that you have a really good week. It looks like you need to come out of this situation of feeling stuck or trapped. Not able to move. You can move. There is an, a lateral move away from drama, the fight, the, the battle, if you choose to do so. Sixes are about choices. Pisces, if you feel like you need a reading, go over to the website and book your reading there. Make sure you use coupon code 10 off 35 That'll get you $10 off any reading, $35 or more. Thank you, Pisces, once again. Take care.